So when you're on the Sync Sketch link, uh, the website, uh, for example, in this case, this is Art 50 Storyboarding. Uh, I'll show you how to individually download the picture. So what you want to do is, uh, first of all, uh, every time you want to view any of these projects or instruction or anything, any announcement, in this circumstance, I'm talking about Project 4 Cinematography Study Stills, which you will need to download or view uh, to draw from, right? I haven't given out any specific instruction on, you know, what to look for or whatnot, but um, what you want to do first is to click this play button on the right side. Then once you click on it, uh, it it lets you go to all these individual pictures. Now you can click on this, go to the next item where I'm pointing, you click on it, and it will let you go to the next image, and then the next image, and one after one another. Let's say you want to download this particular picture, right? And all you need to do is to click on this little um, icon, downloading icon I'm pointing with my uh, mouse cursor right here. Uh, what you really want to do is um, you can either click download current frame or download notes as PDF if there are any notes on top of it, for example. But if you click download current, free, uh, current frame, then it shows on the bottom it's the PNG file is downloading. Uh, then depending on where you've downloaded it, you can either click on show in finder or um, any downloaded, download uh, um, folder you might have in your PC or Mac, you know, then it'll um, allow you to open it. Um, and so, uh, so that's how you would download individual uh, picture. So for example, if I go to uh, Art44, uh, I just, you know, you can go to classes and then click on R44 animation principles. Uh, R44 students are supposed to draw animals from these pictures. And I have this right here, project for animal drawing reference pictures. You just click on the play button like I previously described. And then uh, what you want to do is some of these, some of the images, for example, oh, by the way, I got to, um, you know, uh, because it allows you to draw on the screen. Some of you guys made a mistake of um, uh, accidentally drawing on a, on these pictures, but that's okay. But anyways, so a picture like this, it didn't allow me to post it vertically, but you really want to look at it vertically. And so you, you do need to download it so that you can rotate the, um, the picture or whatnot. So once again, there's this download button right here. You just click on download current frame, right? Then on the bottom, it says it's being downloaded, and that's it. Um, you click on Show in Finder, or click on, uh, you know, whatever it is that um, uh, you know that allows you to do that. Um, then uh, it'll let you open it and then rotate it however you want. Um, and so. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it in terms of downloading, um, downloading each frame. And let's say if I, um, you go to here, um, okay, then I gotta, oops, I gotta erase this. That's okay if you guys make this mistake. I mean, we all are new to this application. Um, so, uh, one more thing real quick. If you go to, um, let's say, if you go to a project, project three, this is for critique. I'll be leaving a uh, critique like this, um, you know, f uh, throughout throughout next week. So you, you can see individual notes on each one of you guys' projects. And uh, let's say you want to download this, right? You go to um, uh, this download button again, and then uh, you can, say download notes as PDF if you if you click on it then um, then it allows you to then it allows you to look at 
the PDF, not just your animation frame, but uh, but it gives you the note and then uh, additional note on the right side. So this can be pretty helpful. You know what I mean? And so then you go back to your window, you know, and then you can either print it or save it as, right? You can download it uh, right here where I'm pointing. So there are multiple different ways you can use this, but um, this pretty much concludes uh, my quick uh, demonstration on how to navigate through uh, viewing each video, viewing each, um, you know, viewing each uh, picture, whether it's a video or picture individual file, and then allowing you to uh, download either uh, the, the original file, whether that's MP4 or JPEG or current frame or note that I, I leave on the screen. Um, so that's how it's going to work. Okay, please, um, please let me know uh, if you guys uh, have any further question. Uh, but I'll keep posting these tutorial videos uh, throughout this week until our first online face-to-face -face meeting uh, next Monday for R50 and R44 and next Thursday for R51. All right, bye.